Hey guys, I I I am Aditya Dadaku. Welcome to this video. In this video, we'll talk about free web development resources to start your journey with. These are absolutely free. You do not have to pay for any courses. These resources are available on YouTube. I'll not only tell you what to watch, but I'll also tell you the order in which to follow these resources. Again, these are not endorsements, but rather uh, some videos that I found for myself. which i believe are good for any beginner so i wanted to make this video because i get a lot of questions like how do i get started with web development should i buy this course no you don't have to you can find these resources for free so i tell you about the videos you can watch complete with the road map and websites to visit but before we dive right into it hit the subscribe button and let's get started So first we'll start with the basics. To learn web development, uh, you need to know HTML, CSS and JavaScript. So these are the three pillars. And to learn HTML and CSS, there's this free course by Simon uh, from Super Simple Dev on his YouTube channel. The best part of this course is by the end of it you have like a YouTube homepage clone built out. So I personally followed this course. It's very good. and you not only build that project but you also have all these exercises throughout the videos that you can take uh, to get better at html and css next to add functionality to your website you need to know javascript which was the third pillar as i mentioned to learn that again simon has a free course uh, it is good if you like learn all these three from the same uh, creator itself so he has a two part course on it So there are two videos that you might have to watch, uh, but by the end of those, you'll know like JavaScript. You will be proficient in it. So after you're done with these basics, uh, you can take up a course. This is optional. Uh, again, if you already know it, you do not have to. But if you want, you can take up a course on Git or GitHub. So there's this course by Kunal Kushwa on how you can use Git and GitHub, which is like really cool. Uh, take that course it would generally help you put up your projects on github and share them to a recruiter and it would also be helpful in your journey as a software developer because uh, you need to know version control now moving on i would suggest learning a bit of back end especially node js for it you can watch this video by john smilga who is a popular course creator he has this video on node js he builds out like four projects and is like really good course to start out with After you're done with Node.js, uh, we'll come back to Frontend again uh, and learn React, which is like a popular library. Uh, a lot of people who start out with web development generally end up learning React. And uh, there is this free course by John Smilga on Free Code Camp. Uh, it is, it is like a video on React, but there is also a course on React projects. So you can watch uh, that too, which would be like a great addition to your resume if you have some like good projects built out. To go further in your front end journey you can learn Next.js uh, start out with this portfolio tutorial using Next.js TypeScript and Tailwind CSS uh, this would be good because it will also teach you a bit of TypeScript and also uh, how to use Tailwind CSS and next uh, take up this course uh, by David on building a full stack e-commerce store so this would be a good addition to your resume again a nice project You can build out another project to add to your portfolio, which would be a complete full-stack social media app. It is responsive. It is built out using React uh, and MongoDB. So you'll learn MongoDB here. After you're done, prepare a nice portfolio. Prepare like add this to your resume, and hopefully you'll get a job as a web developer. And that is all. These free resources would suffice when starting web development journey. So you do not have to purchase any courses. You can start out with them, uh, learn from YouTube, and this should be enough to get a job as a web developer. If you like this video, please do subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.